I'm going to show you how to read a PDF document in Adobe Reader 8 using the Microsoft speech recognition that comes with Windows Vista or Windows 7. This is the speech recognition gizmo up here and I explain how you get that in another video. If you right click on it you can turn it off and I have it off now because anytime it's listening to you it will be executing all kinds of commands. One thing you want to make sure, if you want to navigate a page in Adobe Reader 8 using the speech recognition, you have to have your cursor in the document somewhere. It can be anywhere. It can't be up here in the page numbers or something like that, or it won't obey your commands. You can get it back there with your voice, but this is just about navigating the page. So place the cursor somewhere in the text. Have the text set up. If you like a colored background, that's an edit, preferences, accessibility, page background. Right here, you can change the color. To get your document set up, that's in view, zoom, and then you can fit to width or reflow if you want to really big font. So I'm using fit to width. So I place my cursor in the document. Now I'm turning on the voice recognition. Page down. Page down. Page up. Page up. Scroll down 10. Scroll up 10. Scroll down 20. Scroll up 20. So when you're reading, you'd be issuing the scroll down an amount command. Scroll down 10. Scroll down 10. Scroll down 20. whatever fits the size of text you're using. The other command you might want to use is auto scroll. Now auto scroll is issued by saying press control shift H. You control the speed by telling it to press a number. Press 7. Press 3. Press 4. Now the higher speeds tend to jitter too much and anything over 3 or 4 is really pretty bad. Press Control Shift H. To get it to stop, just say Escape. Start again with Press Control Shift H. escape. So that's all the commands you really need to negotiate the page.